guys and welcome back to mj phone tv currently trending on all social media platform is the alleged disrespect of actor Yimoli to comedian nash boy so guys if you have been following on all social media platform you will find out that this actor Yimoli said something about nash boy which nash boy didn't take lightly so him on the stage Oh my singer, Abira is not the song. He was talking about his music and his voice. He said he was a good comedian and all that, but his voice is a no-no. So Nashboy replied saying that this is not nice, that his colleagues are encouraging him. So why would someone else just come out and say trash and all that about his music? So he only really said other things so when he was doing a comedy video. And not better didn't take it lightly. After this, actor Imoli came out and he made a public apology. He apologized to comedian Nash Boy and he said, Hi brother, first off, I'm sure from the first time we met up to today, we have never crossed each other and we have mutual respect for each other. I have supported your craft and featured in some of your content. I totally respect your talent and I can never water it down. Oh well, if you felt some sort of way about a reference made in the content with Bayou, because this Imoli was talking to Bayou and he was just like in a way of saying something. It was just sarcasm, but this wasn't taken well by Nash Boy. He could have reached out to me like I'm doing right now. He probably would have had a clearer understanding or Bayou himself would have made you understand the direction of the content with him. As against the tweet he just made, in which I take no offense, even though I was never expecting such from you. But this is me saying I'm sorry about it and I hope it eases your mind and it will never repeat itself again. Hours after making this post, actor Imoli has come out once again to attack Nash Boy the comedian saying that he couldn't take his sarcasm and his joke well. According to Imoli, he said, It's crazy how the world will love you for doing something good this minute and the next minute they are criticizing you for something they heard, not even what they saw or see, without evidence or proof. That one came to cry on the internet that he was slapped. The next thing, Nigerians bashed the hell out of Yemi. Same boy still did a live video later that he didn't slap him, he only attempted to. But instant people didn't do anything when Yemi was assaulted. Same guys are threatening him daily on snap openly but nobody they talk. Ordinary sarcasm, you guys are already cussing him out and I'm sure 99% of them didn't watch the full YouTube video. Bay you entered him too, sarcastically, but you guys didn't see all those ones. If anything happens to him now, you hypocrite will act like you guys care. It's the double standard for me. A comedian that can't take a joke, knowing rightfully well that his response will carry a lot of weight. Moral lesson of the story, do you and the world we are just. They don't really care about you like that. I saw some comments and I just couldn't stand them. These people are humans too. So guys, this is it guys. Like hours after apologizing to Nash Boy the comedian, a lot of people were still backlashing Yumoli and all that just because of a sarcastic uh, a remark he made. So guys, what do you really think? I'm going to drop this video right here. So you see the video that made this comedian Nash Boy to, to come out on the internet and say this about him. We can see that some most of your colleagues are integrating or tilting towards the music part. I was in W Bat two happy two nights ago. There's somebody that I need to watch his comedy or the online. Very, very amazing top-notch content creator. The few ones that you know actually do content content with amazing storyline and I saw him on the stage. Oh, my saying that Abira is not the song. So there are chances that maybe for a venture that you to yeah, maybe after writing the lyrics, I just want to give you a couple of advice. Your voice cannot even with that one, even the song is a beautiful song, I love it. But you can tell that the masculinity in his voice is oh god. I'll be your umbrella. Eh? 
His voice is even sweeter than your own. So you, if you want to, if you want to proceed into that line, I have bought permission. Or move. To, you are even. You are Islam, but you can. Your voice is good for the mosque. Am I communicating? It's not that I'm trying to. Just put my plan for 2024. Ah, uh, but there's not a plan. That's fine. Look for plan B, C, or C, or D. You two fly. So, guys, what do you think about this video? Please comment down your views. Hit a thumbs up, like this video, and subscribe. Please and please click the subscribe button. Thank you so much, guys, and see you in our next video. Bye bye. Thank you so much for watching this video. For daily entertainment, news, and celebrity good and bad updates and all you need to know that's happening in the country don't forget to hit this red subscribe button turn on the notification bell to always stay connected to us one love and god bless you all don't forget to thumbs up to this video and comment down below what you think about this